alongside a decent tire, LED lights, and a lift kit, the snorkel would be one of the first modifications in the minds of people planning to buy or already bought a SUV. If you have similar thoughts in mind, this video is definitely for you. Hello and welcome to Indian Chimney Explorer. Why do we need a snorkel? A vehicle takes air from beneath and around the engine bay and this air goes to the air filter and then to the engine. This air is often hot and contains dust and other contaminated particles that can be very detrimental to the engine and its performance. Fitting a snorkel means moving the air intake from beneath your bonnet to roof height. The higher air intake position of the snorkel dramatically reduces dust clogging for your filter, whether on-road or off-road. Let us see difference in the air filter condition of two similar vehicles. One has snorkel and one does not have. Both the vehicles have gone through similar mud terrain for a few thousand kilometers. First, let's see the one without snorkel. There is a good amount of dust and dirt particles that has got into the air filter. Now let's see the SUV that had a snorkel. We can see there is not much dust that has gathered in the air filter. Snorkels are commonly the first accessory fitted to any 4x4 and with good reason. Aside from giving your 4x4 an added aesthetic appeal, the advantages of a snorkel on a 4x4 are numerous, on and off-road. Let's look at some of the advantages and disadvantages. Advantages, aesthetic appeal. A snorkel also reduces the intake of dust and water entering the engine, which translates to improved fuel consumption and less strain on the air filter. Let's see what are some of the disadvantages. Snorkel can be a permanent accessory. It cannot be removed like any other accessory. It will have giant hole on your fenders and there will be a lot of screws. If you go for a cheap unbranded snorkels, which might look the exactly same as the real thing, with subpar plastic, the quality is reduced which means less resistant to UV damage and small impacts. Snorkel is not installed properly or not sealed properly, there will be leakages and snorkel could do more damage to the vehicle. So keep in mind, even with a snorkel, the wading water uh, should be kept to a minimum level. Is it the right investment? Think of snorkel as a long term insurance. It's most commonly fitted to a four wheel drive to protect the engine and owner's life saving. The snorkel allows vehicle to pass deep water crossing like rivers and creeks or anything that is contaminated like dust getting sucked up and finding its way into the engine. However, installing a snorkel doesn't mean huge increase in the fuel efficiency. A naturally aspirated engine like Jimny cannot take in more air than what is needed, needed for fuel com combustion. Some tips. Under a normal on-pavement driving conditions, the snorkel head should be positioned forward-facing, that is toward the front of the vehicle. This will ensure the highest airflow rate to the engine, providing increased power and efficiency. In a dusty or inclement weather condition, such as heavy rain or snow, the snorkel head should be positioned rear-facing, that is towards the back of the vehicle. This will help keep the majority of dust particles, water or snow from getting into the vehicle's intake through the snorkel. So in conclusion, there is definitely a slight advantage of having a snorkel if you are planning to go for one. Thank you. With that, we come to the end of this video. Hope you like this content. Please do share, subscribe if you want to see more such videos. Thanks for watching. Jai Hind.